Well, my first job as a music producer started when I was about 18 years old. Now, I didn't get paid for it, but I was making beats in the back of a couple of independent documentaries and uh, independent internet TV shows. So I started making beats, you know, putting them in there. Then from there, when I moved to Miami, I started making beats for artists. My first job where I actually got paid was for a wonderful female singer. Uh, I had met her actually on MySpace, and I played her some of the tracks. They really liked it, and her and her management came in. They paid us, you know, a, a decent, decent sum for three tracks, and uh, they went on her album, and it was a really great thing. We had a budget, so therefore we were able to bring in, you know, really great musicians and work with them, and the track just came out really amazing. Another great opportunity I had to work with an artist was basically a very young girl. She was 15 years old. I had met her mother, and her mother said she just really wanted her daughter to get into music. Her daughter loved singing. So, you know, I brought them into the studio. They sat. We talked. We, you know, found out what she was into. And basically, we started the song from scratch, uh, writing it with her. I actually wrote the song for her as well. She pretty much just sang it. Um, but it was a really great experience working with the mother and the daughter together to put the track out. An entry-level position in the music industry would basically pretty much be, you know, going to get coffee at a local studio, getting in any way you really can, whether it's, you know, being a roadie for the band or whatever you can to just sort of get into the circle of the industry.